Hey guys, so Tempest here, and today we are back. We are at the Elite Four, we are at level 45, and we are ready to start rocking out. Let's go over our team before we even bother starting. <laughs> it's nice not bother before we even attempt this. We are level 45. Lance's max is round 50, I believe. So we're still going to be over under level for him, but we should be at around a fair midpoint so that it's still a challenge for us. Inosuke, for our fur alligator, Inosuke. <laughs> Look at that attack stat, guys. Waterfall, Ice Fang, Crunch, and Slash. Holding a choice band. Gotta boost up that attack even more, man. That's all I can say. Then we have Genie, the Steelix. 200 defense. I mean, yeah, her special defense is nothing to look at, but uh, that physical defense, anything that I know is going to be throwing out physical hits, hey, Genie's going to take it without a problem. Rocking out with a Zoom Lens, Iron Tail, Rock Smash, Curse, and Strength. Curse to boost up that attack and that defense. Might as well if I can set up. Then we have Shion, our Milotic. Mara Scale ups defense when there's a status problem, which is always nice. Rocking out with the Mystic Water, Water Pulse, Ice Beam, Surf, and Recover. Um, not entirely sure how this one will work out. I... I feel like Shion's going to be doing fine. I know I have two water types, but one's a physical and one's a special hitter. And it's just, it works out. Like, water's a very good typing. Then we have our boy, our starter, Lee the Pupitar. With Shed Skin. Exper the experience share held on just so he can get more experience while we're going through here. Rocking out with Crunch, Rock Slide, Sandstorm, and Thrash. He is here because we are going to be throwing out Sandstorm for Steelix. Uh, at, more often than not, if we need to. His stats are alright. They're not, like, anything too, too grand. But they're not, in, they're not terrible. They're not terrible. We can work with it. We can work around it. Then, we have Taruki with Wise Glasses. I did have him with Mind Plate to boost up Psychic. But, seeing as Energy Ball might be needed... I uh, am more or less rocking out with wide glasses just so I can boost that up. That special attack stat is scary. Rocking out with Psychic, uh, Psychic Recovery, Reflect, and Energy Ball. Then we have Sokka, our Togekiss, rocking with Serene Grace. So, hey, we're more than likely to get stuff. Rocking out with Shadow Ball, which may lower his potions, opponent's special defense. Uh, Aura Spear, because... It's better than Steel Wing. Metronome, because why not? I could have replaced this with anything. And Air Slash, because it can cause a flinch. I gave it Expert Belt, so in case I am just hitting for super effective damage, it's going to be doing more. I do have a very heavily leaning special team, but it's not necessarily too bad. And our final call before we go into Elite Four is... Ian, what do you want? Howdy, uh, how are you? Tis, uh, yeah, yeah, okay, bye, 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 bye. Anyway, let's, let's actually get going. I did buy all the items that I'm going to need from the store. I bought full reef stores and I bought, uh, hyper potions to, well, heal up. I don't have any elixirs because I didn't find any. You can't buy those. We're going to rock out with the Inosuke to start out with just... Hit like a truck and keep on going. I do plan on I do plan on splitting these up into each elite four member. So do not be surprised if this episode is really short and the next episode's really long. Or I might just divide it up into two at this point because depending on what you got, Hippopotas is not gonna like a dang waterfall, man. Goodbye, Hippopotas. Oh no, we start out with... I FORGOT TO TURN THE THING ON! I forgot to turn on, uh... Battle animation, because I had it turned off for grinding. Oh well. Not really missing too much. Apparently, this Psychic-type trainer is a Rock-type trainer! <laughs> or a Ground-type trainer. One of the two sand buffs. Oof. Dialga. Ooh. 
Does steel resist ice? I don't think it does. Ooh, we should be able to take that. Okay, yeah, we're gonna be able to take that. That's... That was a lot weaker than I thought it would be. How long is this sandstorm going to be up? Ooh, I just walked into the worst possible thing. Why would you... Oh, I guess going for Aura Spear makes sense. Never mind. And you outspeed me? Oh, man, that's terrifying. This Dialga is... Oof! That Dialga is just... Mm. <laughs> See? I'm not I'm not overpowered, guys. Oh, yeah, Sandstream's... Sandstream does not go away, does it? Like, if it's set up by Sandstream, it doesn't go away. If it's set up by Sandstorm, it does go away. That's right. This guy has a lot of speedy Pokemon, and I'm thankfully I have good coverage on a lot of Pokemon I need. Mesprit. Uh, that's a flying bug type? Right? No, that's Masquerade. What's Mesprit? Oh! Oh, this guy is rocking out with three legendaries. <laughs> You're thinking I'm... Oh! Oh! Okay, you're going for protect. That's fine. That's fine. This fight is a lot worse than I thought it was going to be. I thought we were going to... I thought the first two were going to be somewhat okay to fight. No. No. We start out with Technician Joey rocking out with three legendaries. I don't want to hear anything about my good luck when it comes to legendary Pokemon. We narrowly escaped that, guys. I mean... Three of our Pokemon are down to one-third of their max HP. Come on. You can't tell me I'm... Oh, that hurt a lot. Um... I'm gonna have to figure out how to... I gotta heal them all back up. I could have stayed out with the Nosuke and went for Ice Fang, but with the Choice Band, I still don't think that would have done as much as Lee with Crunch. Now, if I had a Nosuke without a Choice Band just boosted by something else, maybe, and I used... I have 12 fully full heals basically left. Oof.